Hi guys, welcome to Office Blokes React. I'm Office Bloke Dave. I'm Office Bloke Mike. I'm Office Bloke Dan. Together, all three of us are together, together again. Together again. Together. Indeed. It's true. Yeah. Back from the dead. Yeah. Complete. <laughs> Complete. COVID completed it. Completed it. Yeah, fair, fair enough. enough. <laughs> I'm not sure if I had it or not. I think it was just a... You tested positive, didn't yeah, you? Yeah, but I don't... It was an old kit. <laughs> right. <laughs> and also you didn't... Someone else had used it. <laughs> Someone else had used it. Yeah, yeah you did put up your bum, don't you? <laughs> Someone else had used it. <laughs> anyway, uh, we did airline passengers losing their stuff, number one. I don't know how many seconds... When you say losing their stuff, does that mean like the bags and stuff? Yep. Yeah, yeah. Uh, luggage and things like I that. I don't know yeah. how many seconds we are in, and I'm not 100% of the rules at the moment. So. Seven. Seven seconds. Right, airplane passengers losing their shit, number two. Did did all three of us do number one? Yeah. Uh, I'm not I sure you one? did it, mate. I'm not sure if I did or not. Depends how recent it was. Oh, it's done a couple of weeks, weeks ago. ago. Oh, I think I might have missed it then. Oh, oh. oh you're probably on holiday. Yeah. It's not like me. Might be on all <laughs> these videos. Probably, did, you ever, yeah. did you ever watch Airline, I think it was called? Was yeah. It Airline? Yeah. yeah. It, it's clips from that, but it's people losing it. Ah, right. It's okay. at the bottom there, Airline. <clears throat> yeah. Ah. Right. Yep, yeah, let's do it then. Airline passengers losing their shit, number two. Right. Maybe. What should I do? We're going to get your bag up from the aircraft. And, and what should I do? We, Where am be, I going? We won't be accepting you. You can't throw things at people once when we're I don't telling you throw it I'm, I'm in a hurry no, 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 you throw it we, we can't I'm accept ready. you with that carry on I can't believe it definitely not <coughs> really that's not possible that's not possible no no, no I can't we, we tried to, we've explained <laughs> give it a rest I think you make the right decision there yeah Okay, so about two weeks ago, I uploaded a video of some of my favourite Airline UK clips and within days it hit 1 million views. I made a second version with a voiceover to replace the text-to-speech commentary and there were so many nice comments saying do another one that I decided to do exactly that for this video. This next clip was actually featured for a few seconds in the first video, but the squeaky mouse lady is such an Airline UK icon. I thought I'd show you guys what happened once she brought the frequency down. Oh, no, really, you can't get on that floor. Oh, no! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> it's like a chair leg on the floor. Right? <laughs> it's, it scrapes on the floor. Yeah. Playing tennis, I'll take the playing squash in the gym. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> squeaky trainers. Michelle Salinger has arrived 15 minutes late for the morning flight to Barcelona. I'm interviewing a whole load of teachers. What are they on the list? Thing oh, is, I, I like someone might have died, and that's the you know, yeah. It's really interviewing teachers. You're we, late. Oh, we'll strike anyway. <laughs> we kind of had this debate on the first one we did, where it's like, well, it wasn't even a debate, was it? It's a discussion. Like people are turning up late. You turn up late, and you go, "Oh shit, I can't get on. It's my bad. It's my. I'm late. It's my mm. fault." Yeah. But there's these people who absolutely lose their mind for something that's their fault. Mm. As if these people are going to do something for them. <coughs> yeah. It's like, you're, you're late. Speak, so, people know for airlines as well, you've got to be on time, haven't you? They don't say, oh, early. I'm running late, you just hold it on the runway for 15 minutes while I get there. Mm. They, you know, they have a time to yeah. go and just go, don't they? Everyone knows it. That's what always said to me one day, the plane ain't coming back for you, mate, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Don't, doesn't it cost like tens of thousands per minute it sits on the runway Probably. or something? Yeah, some... you, have, you have slots and everything, and it's a slot that yeah. fits in for all, all kinds of scheduling from departure to arrival to yeah. you know, passing through, whatever you don't want to Even with doing. the stuff with baggage, yeah. baggage, baggage yeah. handlers being yeah. available when you get there and you yeah. know, things like that, it's all, yeah. They can't yes. hold everything up for Karen, the teacher, can they? Unfortunately not, no. I'm st st at, a, at a college and then I'm going to a university to interview teachers as well. And I, I let them down last time because I, because of the September 11th thing. They're all set up for me to see them and I let them down at the last minute. And I, you know, I can't let these guys down. They've given up their time for me. They've rescheduled all their classes for me. She's desperate to be allowed on the flight, but it's not looking good. No, 7.20, oh, please. no, sorry. I've got to get on. The flight's on time, let me just check. Oh, please, please, I've got my appointments. I've got 20 people waiting to be interviewed by me. Oh, please don't do this to me. I've got to phone up to my... Oh, that must be somewhere you can get me No, there isn't, honestly. Just 
confirm the Barcelona's on time. Michelle's pleading wins her one last chance. OK, thank you. Bye-bye. Yeah, he's definitely on time. Oh, no, <laughs> but she's out of luck. The next one is at five past one. That's so good. Got to beat them before. Oh, oh, Look, can you not get me on it? I can't get you on the 7.20 now. Oh, God. The next Barcelona flight won't even leave until after Michelle should have arrived. It's not one of her better mornings. Wouldn't you go, I'm just going to check if there's anything we can do for you. And just be like painfully slow down, <laughs> pull out a book and just be like... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, get there on time. Simple. <coughs> early. Got one job to do. You've, that's your if, job for the day. Yeah, if it's that important, it's to get, if it's that important, yeah, get there early. Like yeah. I say, get there yeah. early. Well, well early. Yeah. Just make sure she's well, well late. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Last time I flew, I got I was the first one in the airport and into the departures lounge. It was literally they were cleaning the floors and it was just me sat there, nothing open. Uh, I'd overcooked it. I, I mm. thought it was going to take me half an hour. Yeah. Got a taxi at like three in the morning and was at the airport by five past three. And just went straight through, and I sat there like. It's the worst part of any kind of travel is going on the going to the airport and doing all and dealing with all the crap that you I have to go through. It, yeah, yeah. It's, it's, yeah it doesn't mind nothing. Yeah, but that's why you get it's, there early, isn't it? Yeah. Trying to avoid distress. Yeah, absolutely, yeah, yeah, yeah of course. It's time. I could have got that flight. They let me go at five past. Well, you should have arrived on time. You don't even know how to fly. What an idiot! Yeah. With little real choice, Michelle agrees to take the later flight. I just feel sick. At Luton, passenger patience is running out fast, and the news isn't getting any better. We've just been told that the Barcelona flight's just been cancelled now as well. And these guys have been waiting here since about one in the afternoon. It's now nine o'clock. This has got wow. to be the worst day that I've ever had here. Crazy. Leo's actually such a champion, isn't it? Yeah. Like, how many series have gone by in every episode? He deals with people so well. Yeah. OK, passengers travelling to Barcelona. There are no more seats until the 1st of January. Oh, God, here we go again. <laughs> Good luck, Leo. <laughs> 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 that is pain. I have to be in Barcelona tonight. I if it's not tonight, to tonight, we don't care. We have to be in Barcelona. And you let me know whether you'll be refunding the transfers, the other end, and the hotel. I can't say we're that. Only going for I why can't. can't you say that? Because I don't have that information <laughs> to give. It. We don't have that information <laughs> what do you to mean give. You don't have it. Someone's got it. No, there's a complaint procedure in place. I'm what we're recommending. It's the Cockney Norm Macdonald, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I, rec I, I recognise his face. He does look familiar. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but he's, I mean, you sympathise with this if they've already been there eight hours. Oh then, yeah, I mean, then it's been cancelled. That's not their fault, though, is it? You no, know, it's out it's, their control, isn't it? Ah, uh, just one of them. Me, where you give it a certain time, find out what's going on. Just like I say, Dip pull out. someone to the side and go. Is it worth me staying? Yeah. These people just want something to happen to complain. You know, nothing's going to happen for eight, you know, yeah. eight hours. Yeah, and I'm off. Yeah, move on. I'm on another airline. Yeah. If you're the first one to say. You know what? Just get me on the next flight yeah. before you know before all this kick off, yeah. and then you just like go and get a hotel yeah. or yeah. whatever. You know, go and occupy yourself for eight hours or Easy however. Just ask someone on the side and they, what's happening with that flight? Is it even arrived yet? No, yeah. not even arrived yet. All right, see you later. Gone. Yeah, yeah. sorted. Then, so you jump what we want to get to Barcelona what, tonight. What we're recommending is you keep your receipts and writing. That's the complaint procedure. Keep your receipt and writing. Write it to our to our customers. Stelios, that print. To our customer support that unit. Stelios. Okay. You've cut that pride you out deliberately. You know I'm taking I'm taking I'm I've checked Gatwick and Stansted and now well, all his destinations no good to me. i got the money to get okay, there. There's children around. Can you just yeah, I'm sorry. Well, I've got the money to get there, mate. Okay, so you need to the language down. <laughs> okay, but where are you going to get me a Barcelona before tomorrow? I can't. Why not? Because there are no more services. Why not? There's no seats. Why not? There's no seats. Why not? There's no more seats. Why not? Good luck. It's not an answer. It's not Sorry. good enough, mate. It's not good enough. Why, 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 why. Please, Sorry? please. There's people who are working tomorrow and they have to be tomorrow in Barcelona. So, well, it's your responsibility to find a flight for us. Excuse me, what's that? Is that an agreement with you? Yes. Are you going to honour it? I'm, I'm, it's I'm agreement. Trying to help. I'm trying to no, help you're not. You. You're just saying you've got all nothing. All I'm doing shaking, is isn't it? So yeah, what information? Yeah. You've got nothing. I've got an agreement with you, and you've broken it. Okay. Yeah, you've broken it. What's you going to do about it? 
I'm acting as a representative yeah, on you're behalf doing of great. All you're saying is you've got nothing. I've okay. got an agreement in front of me. That other guy trying to chime in as well. <laughs> I know, yeah. Now's my chance. Ace. No matter how much, how much are you going to yell at him? I can see how much you want the vent to anger, but they yeah. must know that it's not his fault. Yeah. He's just like the go-between, isn't he? He's just, he's just relaying the bad news, unfortunately, yeah. isn't he? So It's a, it's a stressful thing, and I sort of sympathise of course it is. with him, because you're going to want to go mental, aren't you? Some people, what, if they're travelling, you could be going for a connecting flight, and there could be all sorts of reasons. that You, you know, when people are flying, it's usually for a specific reason, isn't it? And you usually need to be somewhere. Yeah. You know, you've got the flight that day for a reason. Sort of thing, but certain airlines I swerve purely based on the facts of the, the reputation of yeah you know, cancellations, lates. Like these you know. are these out of business now. Yeah. Easy jet, easy jet. No. Still going. going. No, still going. No, still going. Mm -hmm. right. Huge easy jet. I think uh, I the last one I flew with was Fly B. I think mm, it was. They, they've business. gone out of yeah, business. Yeah, yeah. I know one or two of. Mine was uh, it was only flying to Newquay and mm. it was delayed by six hours. Could have been. I, like, I could have driven there. Yeah, it was pointless. Yeah. <laughs> Mate, add a quid. Okay. Well, where is it? I'm getting getting angry at me it. is not going to help the situation Sorry? at all. I can't, I can't pull planes well, out What's the point of you answer. sitting there and doing nothing then? I'm trying to transfer people. Does anybody want to be transferred for the 1st of January? Lots of seats. Well, that's a lot of oh, good oh, after New Year's Eve, isn't it? You stupid bird. Just give me reason. <laughs> it, was due to, it was due to weather. <laughs> no, <laughs> Oh. Now, I know he's been told he can't fly to Barcelona for New Year's Eve because of extreme weather, but to still want to fly out and risk his life to get there, this man must either absolutely love the sesh or Tony Soprano's hosting a mob meeting and Don Corleone's told him he can't be late. And then I do not forgive. Exactly, mate. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Why do I well, do now? My hands are tied. No, they're not it's tied, mate. I've else. got to sleep tonight. It's nothing else. No, I've got to sleep. I've got to sleep, mate. Okay. Okay. What you got to do I about it? I can't do anything here Why for not? you because I've got nothing that I can do. Well, what's the point of you bleeding coming down then? Okay. Oh, like you are a waste of time. Got some flights to Malaga oh, tomorrow. Oh, fantastic! Malaga. Any other place? Oh. Girona. Yeah, it's Malaga. Girona, Madrid. Girona. I mean, Malaga is Malaga far, Girona. far. What south about Girona? Oh. Girona. They're telling us there is no stop anywhere in this country of EasyJet to get us little crowd to Barcelona for a New Year's Eve celebration. Adios, amigo. Correct. Mr. Williams, along with most of the Barcelona. To be fair, it's this New Year's Eve. Yeah. It sounds like it, yeah. And you're flying out for that night to celebrate yeah. for New Year's. Yeah. It's leaving it a bit Cutting late. it fine a bit. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. But then That's, again, you, know if you book a far. flight, you expect it to be there as well, don't you? That's <laughs> true. To be mm. fair as well. Well, still, if but, you're going to go and have a big night out with loads of people, you'd want time to freshen up and it'd be cheaper to yeah. fly the day off. Probably, yeah. I mean, it's the time of year where you can get more extreme weather, I suppose, in Europe as well. Yeah. Especially with snow and ice and, th you know, you just never know, do you? But you just wouldn't risk it, would you? Yeah, it's, it probably is leaving it a bit late, but you do expect the flight to be there, so it's a bit of a, yeah, catch-22, really. I find travelling like that quite stressful, like it pisses mm. me off, you know, yeah. and I can sympathise with people like this, but that's why I'd rather go earlier and just relax. And but be it's okay. the budget, yeah. when you're booking with budget airlines, you've got you've got to expect what you get. It yeah. says what it, you know, it says what it does. Yeah. It says budget. Yeah. If you want to fly something, it'll be better fly than if you're going somewhere like uh, Barcelona. Go with like you know, uh, Iberia, British Airways, yeah. Yeah. something like that. You know, scheduled national airline, not a budget airline. You're gonna be yeah. pay, pay a little bit more than you know you're getting there. True. Yeah. Mm. Get what you pay for, I suppose. Don't yeah. you? In any yeah. walk of life. Yep. You Burke. <laughs> you Pratt. <laughs> Owner passengers opt to transfer to the next day's oh. Madrid flight. <clears throat> Back in the airport, the check-in desk is as close to a plane as some people ever get. I can't, I can't get anybody else onto it now. When's the next one? Uh, not another one till 9.40 now. And, and oh, we have to close on. the flights at 30 minutes before. There's, oh, there's no on, leeway around please. it. I can't. I wish we could. I know you've noticed that I haven't boarded, but even then, we can't get anybody yeah, else I on it. I can just run up there. It's not, it's not a case of, of just running, oh, we can't. come on. I'm sorry. You can't make me wait two hours here. Please, <laughs> you really I'll double check can't. with dispatch. Please. What is it? Is it a meeting? It's a really important meeting. What You don't get up at 5.30 for nothing. A seasoned traveller, Lucy Daniels has arrived... I was going to say, I think she's probably a teacher. She's going to a conference with all the women, isn't she? Woman. Yeah. Yeah. She looks like a teacher, doesn't she? Yeah. yeah. Late at check-in for her flight to Glasgow. 
Well, I'm five minutes after the gates closed. I've got no check-in, and they won't let me on the flight. Because you're late. The yeah. gates closed. Oh, you said it yourself. We can't. Unbelievable. It's not good enough, you know. It really isn't good enough. I hate how these people turn up too late mm. and then act like it's the airline's fault. You yeah. can see them deep down slowly realising who's really to blame. It's not your fault. I know. It's not your fault. I know. No, no, you don't. It's not your fault. <laughs> it's pathetic. I mean, can I just not go to the gate now? No, you can't. Because the flight is shut now, we, we've got to have a cut-off point. We can't keep accepting, accepting people. But it's, five, it's like under five minutes. No, we can't keep accepting people. Or else we'd never get away. Else waiting. I'm if sorry. there were ten people waiting, I'd understand I'm sorry, it. We can't. I've checked with dispatch. You check. So am the I captain. definitely on the next yes, flight? Yes, at nine forty. So what do I do? Just check in at seven forty for the nine forty flight. All right, guys, that's it for today. When I made this video, I actually had enough clips for a twenty-minute video. So if you guys like this again, let me know in the comments or leave a like. There's a whole series of them. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Whole series of people being late for a flight. Yeah. yeah. Unbelievable. Uh, it's, it's like you say, there's a cutoff. That's the time. It says it every on every document you get from the airline. This is what time you need to yeah. be there. Yeah. No. I've never seen an airline that doesn't give that, up, that information no. up. Yeah, because you have to go through procedures, don't yeah. you? The pilots with the, you know, getting the aircraft ready. Security. Uh, yeah. Security, you have to get the, the door shut and everything, get the steps away. They can't just, oh, there's someone else in them, get the steps back out and open the door. I mean, yeah. it takes, all these people? It takes a few minutes to check someone in as well, doesn't it? Of course it So does. you're already five minutes late, yeah. and it's going to take a few more minutes to check you in. Then you've got to get to the gate. Yeah. It's like you may get there 10 minutes before the flight goes off, but it's all... It's like anyway, you go for the train. I've been in trains for... You know, here and there through to London, York, and stuff. She usually go at a time and it pulls away on that time. Yeah, you don't wait, you know, people's well, no waiting. You know, if someone's running down the thing, it doesn't stop and let no. someone else get on. No, they shut the doors and that's it, and then <laughs> yeah. it's, and it's away. Right. No one sympathizes either. Yeah. <laughs> someone's running for the oh, train yeah. and you're no, on it. Exactly. We've all been there. Yeah, but, um, <laughs> and the train stops. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, you're like, ooh. <laughs> Especially when you're abusing some big, like, six and a half foot <laughs> meathead. It was a great programme, that, though, wasn't it? It was. It was I, really I watched good, a bit actually, of it yeah. here and there. Yeah. But he's, yeah the, he's quite good, that guy. I remember him being on it. He was one of the main ones on it, wasn't he? Uh, the guy behind the desk there. Right. But, but, to, yeah. But yeah. to keep calm like that in the face of the abuse, I mean, you've got to have a certain... I couldn't do it. There's no. There's one on the States. That'd be difficult. Airport. Um, I think we're based on Southwest Airlines, right? Yeah, sort of thing. So similar sort of like setup, sort of thing. But I enjoy things like that because it's, I love seeing people angry on set. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> I just funny, I could it? not do that job. There's no way I could sit on that desk. I'd get sacked after a couple of days. Yeah, you'd become very sarcastic, wouldn't you? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'd, I would. Yeah. I'd be passive aggressive. Like Bye. I say, Bye. Yeah. I'll, I'll, <laughs> next. I'll phone dispatch and check, and you would just be going. Ooh. Dispatch, yeah. No, yeah, she was uh, she was 15 minutes late. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's her again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's pretty short, pretty ugly looking. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. What's your name, Elizabeth? Yeah, it's that Elizabeth woman. Yeah, that's, you're right. <laughs> yeah, she is. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, hope you guys enjoyed oh, it too. Don't forget to like and subscribe. We'll catch you on the next one. Cheers, guys. Cheers.